So here's how you find one fourth of three eighths. It's helpful when we have one fourth of three eighths, a fraction of something. Instead of of here, let's think of this as multiplication. So one fourth times three eighths, it's the same thing. Now it's not so bad. We take the numerators, we multiply one times three, that gives us three, and then we take the denominators, multiply those across. Four times eight, that is 32. And we end up with one fourth times three eighths is three thirty seconds. You could also say one fourth of three eighths, that's three thirty seconds. And this is in simplest form. We can't reduce this down any further. Note that it doesn't matter if you have one fourth times three eighths or three eighths times one fourth. The order really doesn't matter here because we're doing multiplication. But that's it. That's one fourth of three eighths. You end up with three thirty seconds. It's Dr. B. Thanks for watching.